waters, when they evaporate, meet at a global conference to speak of fish dropouts, obscura of clouds, near deaths, hydrological dynamics, monocultures and metals, nickel, lead, chromium at their beds. The bend is notional. Water for coffee, cane, banana, paddy, mills, distilleries, fertilizer plants. The Aral Sea was water for cotton in Uzbekistan. One shirt drinking 2,000 liters. Now, more saline than the Dead Sea. Palm-sized, a fossil tiger's footprint. Plains of salt, toxic dust storms, fishing towns, now ship graveyards. People sick, dumps of pathogenic weapons, making the summers hotter, winters colder. The Aral Sea is the Aralkum Desert. And if seas made maps, rivers homes, men borders, the Kaveri too is uprising, one of the longest running rivers over her water share to ripple greens for Karnatak and Tamil Nadu, where her sand beds expand for mining, flowing from Brahmagiri on her way to the Bay of Bengal. She worries if those warring over her understand that a river is a person, like Wanganui of New Zealand, Ancestor of 140 years that got legal status through the longest running litigation by the Maori people because mountains too are equal to men. Thank you. Environment and empathy. It is sad, even tragic, that we have reached this point of having to consciously cultivate empathy for the environment and compassion for the lives of all the creatures that live on the earth. This first painting is about human interaction. Two dancers create a symbol of infinity, symbolizing the infinite potential of human cooperation and interaction in turning the tide and solving this problem. The next painting is about the beauty of nature and our dependence on animals, other creatures, especially the cow. In Africa, the car is a symbol of wealth and respected as such. In India, the car is worshipped. The tree is one of the best symbols of our dependence on nature. The tree emanates the oxygen we breathe and absorbs the carbon dioxide we emit. And the last two paintings are about the grandeur of nature, the beauty and grandeur of nature. And the very last painting is a symbol of the heights of wonder that we can reach and scale when we work together to solve this problem and to cultivate empathy and compassion for nature and all the creatures that live with us. May the conference make positive steps towards turning the tide and restoring harmony amongst us and harmony with, between us 
and the environment. I love it the diversity and the depth of culture and spirituality here in India. Here I'm presenting some works with turmeric, one of my favorite materials. It's gold and bright, it's an underground sun, it's goddess herself, it's purifying, the ritual. Early morning with turmeric powder in my hand, I went to the garden and draw into the landscape directly making a dialogue, asking and listening, exchanging our feelings, connect the morning mist, birds singing, murmuring prayer, cooling air, sunlight, endless blue sky, connect everything in the universe with turmeric in my hand, with a golden thread, going around and around, dissolving into the landscape, embracing and dissolving my heart into the heart of the universe, merging into one. Hello, my name is Priyanka Jain. I am basically from Rajasthan and currently living in Melbourne, Australia. And I've loved art since my childhood. Used to do it before but left it. And from last two years I've started it again and doing my acrylic paintings and watercolor paintings. Uh, mostly my work consists of nature painting. So this one is an unexplored island that gives you a desire to leave all worries and go there and the second one is a door that is not very fancy but it's very inviting with the beauty of nature around it and the third one is these drops on the leaf that are very divine but transient so is everything around us so I do value my environment and try to be empathetic to it thank you Hello, I am Lakshman L.A., visual artist from Hyderabad. I prefer to paint people and environment in my village and sharing beautiful moments with them. I like to depict happiness one can derive from small things in life. I try to bring joy to my people through my colors. Not just sticking to that, I have been consciously contemporized the socio-political and uh, cultural issues around the people. Now, I am presently working on a new series called Pulamma. Thank you. Hi, this is Nirmala Biluka and uh, the current series I'm showing here is titled Made in India. The series is inspired from Indian philosophy of uh, Prakriti and Purusha where both are equal and opposite forces that bring creation into being and uh, mostly my works are centered around the female uh, or the Prakriti uh, which is believed to be the consciousness according to the Sankhya philosophy and uh, I, try to show, I try to show how um, being a creator or an artist myself um, I relate very much to nature or Prakriti uh, which again creates, sustains and also has the power to destruct so a few works here are very metaphoric um, for example, in one of my works, I show 
myself as the Brahma, uh, as holding a egg and uh, holding a sprout in another hand, uh, which is representative of creation. Um, and in another work, a woman is shown with the five elements of nature, such as fire, land, earth. Sorry, uh, fire, earth, water, ether, uh, etc. Thank you. Namaste. I'm Kaveri Bose. I'm an artist based out of Kolkata, India. I primarily get inspired to paint from my travel stories on subjects like people, nature and wildlife. I am thankful to Sejuri Collective Society for giving me this opportunity to participate in this online conference. And I have three paintings on the theme of environment and empathy. My chosen environment is the sea or the oceans that roughly constitute about 71% of this planet. So let's take a look. Thank you. This painting title is Disintegration, that of the polar ice caps due to global warming. Since 1990s, Antarctica has lost significant amount of ice. It is responsible for a third of all sea level rise. The second painting shows impact of global warming on coral reefs. A spike of 1 to 2 degrees centigrade in ocean temperatures for prolonged periods turns corals white and they eventually die. The final painting shows restoration of the coral reefs, empathizing with the environment, the sea, for a sustained marine life, enriched beauty and sustenance of our planet. Hi, I am Geeta Vishwanath from Baroda. I write when I am sad and I paint when I am happy. I began painting about five years ago. I started drawing mandalas as a meditative practice. Gradually I realized that I enjoy drawing and painting and started trying mediums such as acrylics and watercolors and oils also. I then enrolled for a beginner's course at Vadodara Visual Arts Center. I would still say I am a greenhorn who paints for the sheer joy of it. The three paintings I have submitted here are correct, collectively titled as Odes to a Pristine Past. This is Piali Shah from North Bengal, India. Her first painting is titled Trees have souls too. Look how the trees converse with each other. Her second painting is titled Brain Empathy. Here she is trying to show how human brains connect with other human brains and the nature around. Hello everyone, I'm Samriti Gayan. I'm 12. I am a student of Garden High School and the author of a book named Haze. I have tried to show through my drawing that Mother Earth is calling human beings to wake up and save her from destruction. The caption of my drawing is, Wake up, Earth is calling. Thank you.
we close this virtual art exhibition on environment and empathy with an excerpt from Romidonath Thakur's Boshum Thara. He's the one who actually showed us the way to internalize nature. Here is the quote. You are mine, dear Mother Earth, have been for time immemorial. Ever since you merged yourself with mine in mud and soil to circumambulate tirelessly in the expanse of the galaxies for countless days and nights on and on. Saplings have risen from me, flowers too, in their abundant splendor. Forested green, fruits have taken life from me, scattering the perfume of eternal bliss. Amar prithibi tumi bohu boro sher. Tomar mrittika shane, amai mishaye loe ononto gogone, ostranto chorone koriacho prodokin, shavi trimondol, oshunko rajuni din, jug jugantor thori. Amar majare, utiace trino tabo. পুষ্প ভারে ভারে ফুটিয়াছে বর্ষণ করেছে তরু রাজি পত্র ফুল ফল গন্ধ রেণু